hello guys welcome to today's video by trust stanley and this is another ts tech talks video on today's video guys i'm going to show you how to make use of telegram on your desktop application or your desktop laptop or your pc you can call it your pc now in order to make use of telegram all you need to do is to go ahead and open a browser and type in telegram now um type in telegram.org and then click on send wait for it to load up once it loads up scroll right, right down a little bit you are going to see different version from the top you are going to see android and iphone and then on the bottom section you are going to see pc slash linux and then mac go ahead and click on the app appropriate um pc you are making use of you already know your laptop if you're making use of um a windows or you're making use of a mac click on any of them that correspond now i'm going to click on pc for my case now for pc they actually have different pc version just in case you're making use of a different laptop to download this particular software if you have um a windows 64 laptop and download if you have a Windows 32 laptop and download a Windows 64 laptop from a different system and send it to your system and try to install, it is not going to work. That is because you are making use of a different version of Windows. So um, in order to confirm the Windows, go ahead and click on your folders area on this section and then click, make sure you have uh, my computer selected. Click anywhere inside after you selected my computer and then you notice this um, property section right here. Go ahead and click on that. Once you click on the property, it's going to show you different property. It's actually going to show you everything, um, every information about your system. And this is actually what we want to look at, which is actually um, Windows 64 processor that is running on, which is rightly what we want to check. So um, since we have this confirmed, that means our PC is actually our PC is actually a 64-bit PC. So if we are downloading it, we will be able to make use of this particular software on our um, system. Go ahead and click on this button to start the download. But for some reason, I already downloaded this stuff. So I'm just going to go where I have the download saved. Um, I actually have it saved on my downloads. So I'm going to click on my downloads. And now this is the setup right here. So all you need to do to set it up is to double click on it and then install. Wait for it to load. It's going to take a while to load up. And then um, once it loads up, just go ahead and click on OK to confirm your um, you are okay with the settings click on the next and then click on next and then just leave that at default click on next and then start the install so the install is going to take a while um depending on how fast your system is there is no particular or maximum or particular limit that it will take so once it completes just go ahead and click on finish so um it's going to take a little while and then it's going to you're going to notice this option that says start messaging right all you need to do is to start messaging so um click on the start messaging and then it's going to ask you to enter a number that is if you already if you want to make use of this freshly now there are two different options right here there is um to enter your number which is the default one and then it says a quick login using your qq code now what this means is if you already have telegram installed on your phone you don't need to enter the telegram right here so instead of having multiple device logged in, all you need to do is to click on this QQ code right there to have a quick login. Now, um, all you need to do right now is to click on your mobile phone, try to locate where you have um, the Telegram installed, click on it, and then wait for it to load. Once it has loaded up, click on the menu icon right there, and you are going to um, notice on the settings area, click on that, and just try to scroll down a little bit you are going to notice where it says devices right go ahead and click on the devices now you notice where it says scan qq code go ahead and click on scan qq code now you can notice um there are more information that says download telegram on your computer from telegram.com blah 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 just click on the scan qq code because you already have it set so it scanned your qq code and then you can notice it's now logged in so once it's logged in you can just go ahead and chat with anybody that you want to chat on your telegram app right um let me just go ahead and try this out let me try to send a message there you go that's hey bro right now um on my mobile version you can see it actually sends the same message you see so 
once you are logged in right here you can still be logged in right here none of them actually logs out so um you can control it from here or you can control it right here so that is all for today's video guys i hope this video was helpful if it was helpful please smash the like button for me subscribe to the channel and share this video with your friends i will really appreciate if you did share with your friends it will mean a lot to me and i'm going to see you guys on my next video stay safe peace